Welcome to Use Informative Show Your Work question type. To begin, select the Show Your Work button. Your teacher may have already uploaded pictures, words, or shapes into the Show Your Work workspace. On the left-hand side, you'll find the toolbar. The line icon allows you to change the color of lines, shapes, and text. You can also create a highlighter by changing the opacity and thickness of your draw tool. To make dash lines or fill shapes, you can check their boxes on this tool tab. If you're working on a touch screen device, you can also select multi-touch to use multiple fingers to draw at one time. To draw, click the pencil icon. Then you can select between scribble to free draw or line to create perfectly straight lines. Select the shapes tool to add different shapes into the show your work workspace. Then click and drag to place and resize your selected shape. You can also add images to your show your work response. Click the image tool to begin. You can copy and paste an image URL directly into the search box. If your teacher is a premium user or part of a partner school, you'll also see the options upload picture and upload document, where you'll have the option to upload images, docs, or PDFs directly from your device. By clicking take a photo, you'll open your device's camera to take a picture and directly upload it into the show your work response. Don't forget to click add image to insert your images. To type, click the T, then move your cursor and click to place and begin typing. You can use the select tool by clicking on any element. You can resize, move, or adjust the angle you can only adjust elements you have added. To get rid of any element you've added, click the eraser, then click to erase. You can also use the hand tool to grab everything as a group and move it. To zoom in or out, click the zoom in or out button, then click where you would like to move in or out of your view. You can undo any action by clicking the undo arrow. On the right-hand side, you'll see the collapsible question details that you can expand or collapse using the arrow tool. And finally, don't forget to click the blue arrow to save your work for your teacher.